Welcome back, Sebastian here. So time for my review of the 2023 Italian Grand Prix, or not Italian Grand Prix, but the Formula 2 round uh, for the support race for the Italian Grand Prix uh, sprint race at Monza. Of course, when this video was taken, uh, you know, the feature race is already done, but you know, might as well get this finished and over with. So sprint race yesterday, uh, so it started with, uh, who was, who started on pole? Boshong started on pole uh, with for sure alongside him on the front row. Uh, at the start, uh, Ba Sheng, uh, had a lockup going into turn one, had to take the escape road, and basically f completely ruined his tires, and he basically just dropped through the field after that. Um, the two Red Bull uh, Liberty drivers of Hatcher and Crawford uh, basically took that shortcut, basically cut turn two. Uh, so they were under investigation uh, because of that. Um, but let's go through as it happened. So basically after that, um, you know, the driver settled into the lead and Vesti took the lead of the race after that, getting a really good move on there. Um, a couple laps and several laps into the race, uh, Cordiel retired, basically was spun uh, at the Ascari chicane, I believe by Iwasa, I think. I believe it was one of the Red Bull drivers, but basically was spun at that chicane. Um, unfortunately, one of the tricky points with these Formula 2 cars is that they don't have a restart feature on them, so we basically stalled out on the safety car for a number of laps uh, and he retired from the race. Uh, let's see, after that, uh, I think we really saw the two ARTs of Martins and Porsche really starting to cut through the field. Uh, really good top end speed, really good race pace as well for those two cars. Um, further down the field, I think <clears throat> we had a moment as well. Uh, we had a couple moments throughout the field as well. Uh, I didn't really take uh, detailed notes for this race, as you can tell by my kind of just going off the top of my head. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, yeah, it was a decent race, I thought. Uh, I know Nassani uh, basically got kind of spun all by himself uh, at the uh, first, at the turn four or five chicane. Uh, so that was not a great move for him trying to overtake, I believe, uh, Correa. Um, spun, stole the car, brought out the safety car. Yuasa as well was having some issues, some kind of car issues. Uh, so he basically retired in the pit lane. Uh, there was a number of drivers, uh, including, let's see, including Maloney, I believe, uh, who pitted as well, pitted four soft tires towards the end because of that second safety car that was brought out by Asani. But nonetheless, a uh, pretty good race. Uh, and then as we got to the closing laps, overtaking became pretty difficult uh, and there weren't really a lot of moves in the field. So your final result uh, in the race was Vesti uh, first, really good result for him. Uh, winning from third on the grid. Martin second, really good climb through the field. For sure third, uh, probably a bit disappointed with that result, but still pretty good. Pocher fourth, uh, lost a couple points to his championship rival, Vesti today, but still probably not too unhappy with that. Fifth, Miney, seventh, uh, sixth, Behrman, seventh, Leclerc, eighth, Stanek, ninth, Dewan, tenth, Novak. Uh, not a whole lot to say about these drivers, although Leclerc looked like he was making some pretty good moves. And then we get to Hadjar, and Crawford in 11th and 13th. They were given time penalties after the race, uh, which dropped them well out of the points because they, I believe, finished fifth and sixth on the road originally. So uh, not great for them. Uh, Hauger in 12th, uh, I know he had a moment at the Ascari chicane. Uh, not great for him either. Uh, looks like he kind of just lost it there, but managed to keep it under control, but it was a bit of a dangerous move there. Uh, 14th, Maloney, really tough day for him. Really poor call after poor qualifying yesterday. Fair penalty, 15th. Uh, I believe he had a couple instances as well. I don't really remember off the top of my head. 16th Mason, 17th Rubula, 18th Korea, 19th Boshang, and then your three retirements, Iwasa, Nisani, and Cordial. So that's all for my review for the uh, sprint race. Probably definitely not one of my better reviews, but thought I might as well get this out of the way. Um, I'll be watching the feature race a bit later, so of course, unfortunately, I'm a bit delayed there. Um, but, you know, I'm back back home now, so I can do the re proper review with notes and everything. And of course, we'll be telling Grand Prix later today, so that should be pretty fun. So thank you so much for watching, and goodbye.